Creating a Panorama Panoramas can turn routine snapshots into sweeping vistas. These super-wide images are created by stitching together two or more pictures side by side and are perfect for landscapes, crowd scenes and architectural photos like these. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to create a panorama with Roxio Creator. All you need is a set of photos taken by turning your camera as you stand in one spot. Let's get started. First, open Roxio Creator. Then click on the Photo tab and choose Create Panoramas. This will launch the Panorama Assistant. There are just three steps to go through. The first step is to bring in the photos that you want to stitch together into a panorama. So I'll click the Add Photos button and choose the photos from the browser. I can add all the photos for my panorama at once by holding down the Shift key. My photos are of the Massey Memorial in Wellington, New Zealand. I have eight pictures in my sequence, but all you need is two or more. Some of my pictures are in the wrong order, so I'll drag them into place. Now it's time to go to step two. Here, the Panorama Assistant works its magic and automatically aligns the photos both horizontally and vertically so that they begin to merge together. If anything looks out of place, you can click the zoom button at the top and then fine tune the alignment by dragging the photos around. Don't worry if it doesn't look perfect at this point, the edges will be blended in the next step. Things look good, so I'll click Next. We're at the last step now. The assistant blends the edges of the photos together and the panorama is done. Let's zoom in and scroll around a bit to see how it looks. I'm all finished, so I'll save the panorama to put it on my website later. I can also print it out or email it, or open it directly in Roxio Photo Suite to edit it further. Now that you've seen how easy it is to make a panorama, here are a couple of tips. First, use a tripod to keep your camera level as you turn it and take your photos. Second, overlap each photo about 25% with the previous one. That will help them blend smoothly.